Hi, Jen at One Body Massage Therapy. So I just wanted to make this quick video and it's just about the Hoppy candles. I've had quite a bit of um, interest lately. So I just put, I'll put this little bit of a video together just to explain things really. So I'm just going to open these. So these are the Hoppy Ear Candles and they're made of, they're made of um, beeswax. Um, they've got like a little little like stopper at the bottom there and basically what happens is my hands will act as a medium and it'll go into the ear now it doesn't cause any pain as it goes into the ear it just sits so there's not going to be any like any gap to allow like obviously the 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 fumes of the candle to go through so that it'll act as a medium as it goes into the ear onto the side hard to put on yourself and you'll and i'll hold it there. and what will happen is the top will be lit with the flame and the flame will burn all the way down now how long it takes is depending on each person everyone's individual for how long it takes for the candle to burn down and it'll burn down all the way and then once it comes to the line it, it gets taken out and puts to the side both ears are done. I, one ear might take a little bit longer than the others. Again, it is dependent on the person. Afterwards, we will then open the bottom and see whatever's left inside. And then we can make a diagnosis on then how many treatments you might need or what side is different from the other. So these are the candles done on both sides. And that can take anything from 5 to 15 minutes on each side. And as, as I said, it is, again, dependent on the person. Um, it's a non-invasive treatment um, and it's like an ear cleansing technique. It's very soothing and relaxing and it um, helps improve the energy flow through the ears. It's really good for clearing the mind and the senses as well. And it's really good for like headaches and migraines, sinuses, anything like that really. It's, it's really good for those type of things. So these are the candles and they're like beeswax so they're quite soft to touch. It doesn't hurt when it's in your ear. What you might hear when the candle's in the ear is the crackling of the flame going down. But that's all you hear. And obviously my hand's in between the medium as well. Um, so yeah, that's the, that's the hoppy ear candle. It's non-invasive. And then once both sides are done, you'll then lie on your back and you'll have a facial, neck, shoulder, um, pressure points, lymphatic drainage and massage into those areas. Again, helping to increase the benefits of the hoppy ear candles, helping to increase the flow, helping to he move whatever's around, um, increase the circulation and everything like that as well. So that, that's hoppy ear candles. So uh, next I'm going to um, explain like the benefits and certain conditions that it's good for and certain conditions conditions that it's not good for as well so hopefully that's um put hoppy candles to bed and uh, if you'd like to enjoy the treatment just give me a message so following on from the little video about the candles i'm um, just going to give you a little bit more information so hoppy candles is, is a non-invasive treatment it helps cleanse soothe and relax into the ears it helps improve the flow of energy through the ears and helps clean the mind and the senses as well and hoppy candling is always followed by a facial massage which includes pressure points lymph drainage around into the face and into the neck and the top of the shoulders as well and by doing that that just helps follow on from the treatment helps all like the benefits go through and helps open up into the, the facial features as well so the benefits that um, conditions that are going to benefit from the hoppy ear candles are um, earache with the heat from the candle helps soothe it but not anything that's serious if it is a serious earache you will need to obviously go and see your GP for that um, with colds it helps clear the congestion through in, in for the colds but not in the first 24 hours or any serious fevers sore throat it helps with as it's an anti-inflammatory action of the candle helps improve the circulation and also clear the airways as well a really good one is headaches and migraines. I know a lot of people suffer from these. It helps regulate the blood circulation, reduces stress on the cranial nerves. And also when, when the massage is, is introduced as well, it also helps like reduce stress, relax, relax the body as well. Um, tinnitus, it's warm. The warmth from the candles and the massage helps stimulate the blood circulation and helps relax the muscles as well. Moving on to vertigo, again, with the warmth from the candles, help reducing stress, helping the bodies relax. Same with Meniere's disease as well. Um, the warmth, the relaxing, the stress reduction and the improvement in the circulation, which you'll notice is in a lot of these conditions. Um, sinusitis, um, the warmth, helping through the sinus 
on the release points on the face as well with the massage so once the candles has been done it's the certain pressure points on the face that are going to really help release those sinuses and um, hay fever it's an anti-inflammatory as mentioned before providing relief and one for snoring it's a decongestant helps decongest the upper airways and improve breathing as well um, stress again as, as I mentioned before and um, the candle the massage it's relaxing it's calming and it also helps calm the nervous system as well so there's, there's a lot of conditions that can really benefit from hoppy candles and it's not as invasive as evasive as some of the other treatments as well but here's some conditions that are not suitable for hoppy candles and um, perforated eardrums first 24 hours of a fever grommets in the ear cochlear implants in the ear inflammation or infection of the ear First trimester of pregnancy, and that goes with all massage therapies as well. Any skin or scalp infections, any recent head and neck injuries, any allergies to the following condition as following things: beeswax, bee stings, honey, sage, Saint John's wort, chamomile, and vitamin A. The reason behind that is they are all included in some parts of the candle, and also with certain massage oils that more creams that may be used as well. Contagious skin infections, fractures, especially around the face and neck, undiagnosed lumps and bumps, recent operations, cancer, recent really serious dental work, high or low blood pressure, epilepsy and nervous system disorders. Now if, if any of them apply to you, all you need to do is go and see your GP and just mention that you want to come for hobby ear candles and they will give you the go ahead if needs be. So hoppy ear candles treatment lasts around 45 to 50 minutes. It is followed the hoppy ear candle in itself. As I said, each ear can last between 5 and 15 minutes. It's followed by facial massage, pressure points and lymph drainage around the face and the neck. And it is £25 a treatment. So if that's something that sounds good to you, um, all you need to do is drop me a message or an email and let me know and I can get you booked in. Just to let you know that hoppy ear candles is only available at the... Um, Oral Park Base, which is in Joy Hair Salon on Moss Lane.